or Sharon um, um, Alden, yes. Um, both of you came from the biggest love teams in the country, kay Alden, kay me, and then Sharon is with uh, Gabby Robin, yes. yes. <laughs> What would, be the, what would you consider the best and worst parts about being in a love team and your advice sa mga love team sa Philippines Philippine Street? Okay, um, well, there's nothing wrong with being part of a love team and I think it's the Filipino culture and I think we have to respect that. Uh, meron po kasi mga nagko-comment na nakikita natin na parang nilulok down nila yung pagiging part ng love team. And I, 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 I don't, parang it's not, masakit yun on our part. Na no, we, yes, uh, baka kailangan lang mag-reality check tayo, saan ba tayo nag-start? And anything that has been uh, a contributing factor to our career and success, parang no one has the right to look down on that. So being part of a love team, is our culture, cultural uh, belief already and yung, yung that dun kasi talaga nagre-revolve ang Philippine showbiz industry but right now, since we're transitioning with content yes, and uh, parang uh, of course, andun pa rin siya it, it, it's considered as a launching pad for, launching pad for a lot of new actors and actresses but uh, Yun, yun nga po eh, parang I've reached my age already. I'm celebrating my 13th anniversary po this coming December. 13th po pala, hindi po pala. So, I'm very much grateful to be part of the uh, love teams po in the past. But uh, siguro, there are no downsides of it. Uh, maybe siguro parang yun nga lang na in a way na, na yung identity mo as your unique self is always affiliated with another person and vice versa. The same goes to that person as well. So it's up to you. It's up to the actor. It's up to the celebrity if how he or she uh, would want to move forward in this uh, in his career or her career in show business. Ako po kasi, uh, of course, I've been a product of love teams and uh, I'm not ashamed Hindi ko po ikinakahiya na marami po akong naka-love teams before and hindi ko po ikinakahiya na doon ako nagsimula. But I'm very much grateful to the love team uh, concept here in the Philippines. But as right now, as I transition to be my, uh, to be uh, moving forward to my career independently, uh, lahat po nang naya-apply ko ngayon sa mga decision ko is coming from the learnings that I've got during my love team era uh, days. So, cons, very minimal, tolerable, but the benefit of that is, kung ano man po ako ngayon, kung ano man si Alden Richards ngayon, it's because of the love teams that I've been through. And I'm not ashamed of that. Galen! Exactly the same as okay. Thank you. Thank you, Bobby. Kasi di ba we hear, ano Bobby, we hear na, some people are saying Filipinas lang naman yung maganyan eh. Filipino lang naman yung may love team, love team eh. For me, oh, okay, how can you me. say it na in that tone? You should be saying it's part of our culture and our identity since Rogelio de la Rosa and Carmen Rosales, you know, uh, Luis Gonzalez and who was the first Tito Luis? Yes, ano was it? Tita Glo? Tita Gloria Romero. And then Tita Nita Blanca, Tito Nelson de Villa. You know what? I have been paired with, I've had, I've been part of what? Kasama ko si Boye, sali na natin, pero hindi super. In real life, I've had three ka-love teams, four, si Boye, siguro matuturing na rin. Napag-pair ka lang with them, pero tatlo dun kasi, naging real to real. Pero, I am so grateful because I never had a problem transitioning from a project with a love team that everybody loved to doing a solo, considered a solo na walang kalab team, although of course I had all the great support actors there. And then, I had no problem with that, praise God for that, and thank you to my Sharonians for that. And then, when prepare ka sa iba, you're just giving your audience different flavors and different experiences by watching your movies. 
people like all that is, no, I, I hope that people that started out in a love team and are inclined or are suddenly disowning that, I'm, I'm very sad about that. Because like Alden, I'm very grateful to have been part of love teams. Um, because I had no problem translationing into solos. And, but without the success that I garnered with a love team to begin with, paano ako kaya nagumpisa? Nakakadagdag sa'yo, hindi nakakabawas. So, ang importante is, when you do a solo, or you do a movie with another Kalav team, people are still gonna watch you. And some people are gonna love this Kalav team with you, the others will love this other one, the others will love this other one, but always there's you. You're the common denominator. So we should respect that. We should, that's unique to our culture, and we should just accept it and embrace it. Because like I said, since Carmen, the, you know, Carmen Rosales, since it started, it's part of natin yan. You, Ano ba naman yung pakiligin mo yung audience na nag-dream sila na, oh, they might end up together. Diba? It's nothing, there's nothing wrong with that. Because our business is a fantasy, business of fantasy. We make dreams. We make magic on screen. That's part of it. Kaya nga buhay na buhay pa rin ang Sharon ka bilang team, diba? Diba? Unbelievable! Nasa, nasa fantasy pa rin kami. <laughs> 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 Ayun dalawa. Ay, di ba ka Oo. Our next, nakalimuta ko nito yung sinong next. Saka Big Ray Show. Albert Abelida, magbuhay. Chicken Head. Abelida, Chicken Head. Impossible to miss. Okay, magbuhay.